Okay, so now we have the Connect version 2, which does not work with Max directly, but you can sort of make it work with Max. Um, now I'm using the free version of this software called uh, NIMate for the Mac, and you can just download it. Uh, just Google NIMate, where it's at version 2.14. Um, I think it's a paid thing, but I've never been able to figure out what the limitations are. I just run it and it works. So this is the live view from the Connect 2. You can see it's a much more detailed image. Uh, and the great thing about NIMate is it does skeleton tracking. It figures out a lot of stuff that's going on in the scene and tries to draw where it thinks the three-dimensional skeleton is of the person in the scene. So. One of the things you can do is skeleton tracking. So here it's it's grabbing the left shoulder, left elbow, left hand, and then the right versions of all those things too, including the head, the neck, the chest, the torso. Let's turn off hands here. So um, we're gonna send this data to Max on um, over the network. So we're sending the data to 127.0.0.1, which is the internal loopback network. Um, so that's basically the computer referencing itself. So it's sending it to itself. It's going to be visible. This data is going to be visible to every other program on this computer um, over port 7000. So great. It's working. We can see that it's working. It's tracking the skeleton. And then if we go over here in Max, I have UDP receive. That will receive all the data uh, that's coming over the network on port 7000. And we know we're sending on port 7000, receiving on port 7000. So uh, now, if I go over here, I'm looking for left hand and right hand. Now, it has to be spelled perfectly. So the way that this NIMate is set up is it's sending the data left, capital left, underscore, capital hand, and capital right, underscore, capital hand. And that's how it formats the data. So when it sends that data over to Max, we're routing the left hand and the right hand data, which consists, each one consists of three numbers, an X, Y, and a Z parameter. Z is in, so that defines where the left hand and right hand are in three space. So we have an X, Y, and a Z coordinate for hand one and hand two. Now, um, I'm using this object called VEX, V-E-X-P-R, vex, vector expression, to calculate the distance between those two hands. And we can sonify that. So the closer and farther away they are, we're gonna generate a sine wave here. So let's turn that on. Now, if you move left and right, it doesn't matter, right? It's just looking at the distance. And if you were to do it up and down, it would still work. Great. I gotta shut that off. <laughs> so, uh, what about, so this is the Connect 2. It doesn't work directly with Macs. You need this third piece of software uh, or this you know second piece of software. And then you have to deal with the network. You have to send data through the network. <laughs> Flossing like crazy. Um, but it's really powerful. And you can, not, you can do more than just the left hand and the right hand. You can do uh, the shoulder, elbow, hand, hip, knee, foot. You have the entire skeleton, including the head position. So in a lot of ways, using the Connect 2, like what we were trying to do with the Connect 1 to track your head, mm -hmm. might be just a lot easier just to do, plug this in and look at head position. It's gonna give you the Z position too, and uh, I think it'll track multiple people at the same time. It's just, this is really super powerful. Um, apparently you can do hands. I've never really used that. And Have it, you tried faces. the other Connect with this software? I don't think this software works with the old Connect. Okay. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't. Um, but I wanted to show this because it's really uh, it's really interesting, and yeah. I think they discontinued the the Connect Two recently. You can get those for like forty bucks now, also. Right. Uh, so it's a very powerful sensor, right. and uh, this software I don't think is uh, costly. It's showing ads. Maybe this is just the free version. So it, and so far it hasn't limited me in any way, and right. it works really well. Okay, that's it for Connect. Bye.